So thankfully, we are seeing that downward trend this week. This is the chart that anyone can access that CCSD posts of how cases across the district are looking. So if you look at the dashboard today, this week, 114 cases this month, 950 cases, certainly better than what we had seen, certainly in January when there was that five day pause. The health district does say that COVID is spreading less in schools. How do they know this? So health officials have been studying wastewater across the valley to monitor spikes. Most recently, they were collecting wastewater from outside schools across the valley. So how does this work? People who are sick, they shed the virus and the sewage water detects and gives out a signal of how many people may be infected, how much the COVID is circulating. The health district says the signal is weakening even in the wastewater outside schools. But young children are still vulnerable here. Concentrations in school wastewater have also uh, shown declines in SARS-CoV-2. Uh, regardless, uh, the most important thing to do is to get vaccinated, especially if you have uh, underlying health conditions or immunocompromised. There is still a group that's vulnerable, and that's uh, because it's not, there's not a licensed vaccine for uh, two to four-year-olds. So my suggestion would be for that group to surround that child around people who are uh, potentially vaccinated. So Clark County is still in a high transmission phase. Today's case count 414 test positivity going down at 10.3% to get into the moderate category when the CDC doesn't recommend masks anymore. We would need about 164 cases a day and test positivity below 10%. Now nationally, our local results from wastewater is being tracked. This is actually on the CDC website where you can track how wastewater is looking all across the country. So bluer areas mean that COVID, the number of COVID cases is going down. Red areas, pockets are red. That means cases are rising right here in Southern Nevada. You can't really see it, but there's a little blue dot right there indicating that cases are trending down.